charges at Dade's Country Walk babysitting service. Videotapes made by the prosecutors in that case have now been released. Rod Maloney reports. Nana takes her clothes off. She takes her clothes off? And she stands her clothes off. This is just part of a condensed version of 50 hours of taped interviews done by psychologists with children who attended the Country Walk babysitting service. The service was operated by Frank and Ileana Fuster, now charged with molesting the children in their care. I don't like it because it's not very good when you um, touch private parts of your body. The children described sexual activity with the Fusters ranging from ring around the rosy in the nude to outright orgies. Anatomically correct dolls were used in the interviews. Some scenes are just too graphic to use on television. State Prosecutor Abe Laser isn't happy the tapes were released. He's not sure they're admissible in court. Fuster's defense attorney Jeff Samick was also disappointed, saying it's hurting his client's right to a fair trial in Dade County. He tells Channel 6 News that he will ask to have the trial moved to another city. Also unhappy with the tapes release are the people who made them, Drs. Joseph and Laurie Braga. For people to have to face at this time of year, looking at these tapes and on television and reading about them in the papers and seeing these terrible things that have happened to these children is a very, very distressing thing. And we're concerned. We don't feel that the children's rights have been considered, and it really becomes the question of who speaks for the children. Frank and Ileana Fuster are still in jail awaiting trial. It's expected to begin January 7th. But with the release of the tapes, the Fuster's defense attorney, Jeff Samick, says that he will be filing in the next week to have the trial date postponed. Rod Maloney, Channel 6 News.